This video is presented by Rashid Bashu team. The Dr. Rashid Bashu is the first scientist and gemologist in Africa. Not all gemstones, but some contain toxic metals that can react with water, air or skin when you use it. We compiled 45 toxic gemstones you must not use to make gem elixirs or crystal infusions of any kind. Our experts also added the toxic substance in each gemstone so that you can decide which crystal rituals best fits it. Make no delay and share this with your loved ones. 45 Toxic Gemstones Not to Use in Gem Elixirs Which crystals contain toxic elements? Is ruby toxic? Is garnet toxic? Why is Moldavite not recommended for gem elixirs? Why not use selenite in water? Get all your answers cleared right now. 1. Alexandrite As aluminum is a toxic mineral present in alexandrite gemstone, it is toxic for making crystal elixirs. 2. Amazonite Traces of copper are opulently present in amazonite making it too dangerous when dissolved in water. 3. Aragonite you will find calcium carbonate in aragonite and hence using it for elixirs is not recommended. 4. Aventurine As aluminum is prominently present in aventurine, red, green, white and all varieties of aventurine are incompatible for using in elixirs. 5. Azurite Never use azurite to make gem elixir as it contains trace amounts of copper inside. Natural Blue Azurite Malachite Green Mineral, at Perry's Healing Crystals Ascent. 6. Beryllium It is important to avoid making elixirs with beryl group of healing crystals as it contains carcinogen that can affect you. 7. Blue Sapphire You must not use blue sapphire crystals to make gem elixirs because it contains aluminum. 8. Baji Stones the prominent stones for prayers, baji stones are filled with sulfur and hence not recommended for use in elixirs. 9. Chalcopyrite Presence of copper sulfide in chalcopyrite makes it unworthy for using in gem elixir or any water infusions. 10. Chrysocolla Another gemstone that is toxic with copper sulfide is the teal blue chrysocolla. It is toxic in water.